Hi everyone, welcome to the Survivorship Healthy Lifestyle Program. Today we're going to talk about goal setting. So the two types of goals that we're going to talk about today are long-term goals and short-term goals. Long-term goals are the destination that you want to reach. If you're interested in making a healthy lifestyle change, what is the outcome that you're looking for? Maybe it's that you want to lower your blood pressure or you want to be able to be more active with your grandkids. Whatever it is, it's going to be personal to you. The short-term goals are the steps that you can take along the way to help get you to your long-term goals. One way of thinking about setting a short-term goal is to use the acronym SMART. The S in SMART is for specific. You want your goal to be as precise as possible. M is for measurable. This is just a way to see whether or not you've reached your goal. A is for achievable. It's you know okay to be ambitious, but you also want to make sure uh, that you kind of set yourself up for little wins along the way because not achieving a goal can lead to some discouragement. R is for relevant. When you set your short-term goal, you wanna make sure that it has a direct influence on your long-term goal. And T is for timely. And this just means setting a due date for your goal, whether that's tomorrow, next week, or in a month, whatever makes sense for you on your health journey. Here's an example of making a SMART goal. So perhaps your long-term goal is to lower your blood pressure and your short-term goal is to maybe eat more vegetables. To make that goal more tangible and use that SMART acronym, you can say something like, you're going to include a veggie snack at work three days this week. That makes it a lot more specific, measurable, you're giving yourself a due date, and you're really setting yourself up for success with that small goal. So keeping the SMART acronym in mind, try to think of a few short goals that can help you get to your long-term goals. After each topic in this series, try to come up with nutrition and physical activity SMART goals that can help you incorporate healthy lifestyle changes into your everyday life. Be sure to check out the rest of the videos in our Survivorship Healthy Lifestyle program.